Hey guys, this is Dr. JTM Digital Medicine and a Rheumatology Resident and I welcome you to my channel Dr. JTM. But before we get into the video, there is a big surprise for Surgery PG Residents. We have launched a book called Surgery Made Simple for Surgery Residents for their theory exams as well as for the NEET SSMCH exam as well. This particular book is written by Dr. Manish Reddy who has done his MS General Surgery from Government Medical College that is SVMC from Tirupati. At the same time, he is currently doing Surgical Oncology in Mumbai. This surgery made simple book is written from Sabston and also few parts and topics are written from Bailey and Love and Schwartz as well. So the content is top notch. So when it comes to the diagrams, we took utmost care. We made the diagrams do in such a way that you can directly look into the diagram and draw as it is in your exam paper. And what more important is the presentation. We have presented the content in the form of tables, flowcharts, in the form of boxes, everything neat in such a way you can present it in your exams. So quality, standards and diagrams, everything tick, tick, tick. And this book is the book for your exams and don't miss it at any cost. All the Surgery PG residents, you can get this Surgery Made Simple book on my website www.drjtm.com. The link is given below in the description. Go get it. So the tentative date for NEET SS exam has been given. That is November 11th of this year. So not more than 50 days is left for your exam, but many university theory exams for PG residents residents is completing by October, I guess if I'm not wrong. Practicals and theory both will be completing by October and results will be released maybe in November. But these dates are very much close. This NEET SS exam get postponed to December but at the same time NBMS we can never expect anything he can do whatever he likes to do. But point is not that. How you can prepare for this NEET SS exam in this last 50 days? The strategy that you need and material that you need at the same time how many MCQs from which which topics you need to practice is very very important so those people who are preparing from last one year this is the strategy that you need to follow if you really wanted to get some good rank and if you wanted to get a good branch in a good college. So first and foremost thing, let me discuss about the medical group people, the medicine PG resident. Most of you people might be taking a subscription app for Harrison based uh, video lectures and you might be watching this Harrison based video lectures. But by this time, you should be completing all the Harrison based video lectures. If you did not complete the videos, please stop watching right now. Consuming so much of video content in the last 40 to 50 days will not give you any benefit over others. This is a competitive exam watching continuously a particular video on a particular topics will not give you anything. If you ask me personally, did I watch videos? No, I did not even watch one video lecture. I just have made notes from Harrison 21st edition into a simplified uh, notes for myself and I have revised it so good that it really, really helped me. So now is the time that you need to revise your own notes. It can be anything from your uh, Harrison uh, based notes or from the video lectures that you have watched and the notes that you have made or prepared. So revising that particular notes is very, very important right now. If you want my mini Harrison, then definitely I'll be ready to help you. Yes, I have published mini Harrison book for NEET SS exam as well as theory exams. This is the best thing that ever happened to me because after reading this for like four to five revisions, I have got a very good rank and I have been doing rheumatology right now. So I would suggest if you people wanted to revise, this is the book. I have compiled everything, every important important topic in this book. I have also added extra corner topics like PSM, Pharma, recent updates in this particular book so that you will get an extra edge in the NEET SS exam. So it's the time that you start revising with this mini Harrison book which will really fetch you some good marks and also good rank in this NEET SS exam that you are going to appear in this November. It is available for every one of you. You can go get it on my website www.drjtm.com. The link is given below in the description. Go get it. And second thing, MCQs how you have to practice MCQs and also how many days you need to allot for this entire Harrison book chapters. We know that all the questions are coming straight out of Harrison book but at the same time this NEET SS exam has constant repeats from certain chapters. So what are those chapters? How many days you need to focus for each chapter? How many MCQs that you need to practice? Cardiology, Neurology and Gastroenterology. These are the high yield chapters where repeatedly repeatedly questions like high number of questions at the same time 
time high yield topics will be coming from this particular chapter at the same time you need to practice at least 1000 mcqs from each chapter and you allot 5 days at least for each chapter so the next important topics are rheumatology nephrology and infections if you observe the last 3 years pattern of questions they are asking very limited topics from this particular chapters repeatedly so it is very easy to catch those topics if you are very well versed with these particular topics full marks from these chapters for sure you should allot you should at least allot 4 days for each chapter at the same time 500 mcqs from each chapter you can practice only the important topics or the few topics that are being repeatedly asked and the last level important chapters are the basic sciences and hematology and endocrinology only and only the important topics from this particular chapters is enough allot 3 days for each chapter and 300 mcqs each chapter then you are all set i know you might be asking not just chapters we also need important topics don't worry i know about you guys so i have made a very very comprehensive list that is very very important for this neat ss exam and that list is made available in the form of pdf you can download it and get it the link is given below the important high yield topics for neat ss exam if you are unable to download it you can ping me on my gmail or instagram i will send it to you now the next thing how you can practice this many a number of mcqs or what are the best apps that you wanted to have it for neat ss exam i would say only two apps one doc tutorials the question bank two maro the grand test uh, when you ask me the rest of the uh, apps that you wanted to use i am not really fan of them the content is not too much oriented towards the neat ss so i am not fan of them but these two apps will really really help you the q bank of docty is the best and the grand test from maro is the best so using these two apps will actually get you almost below 500 or 1000 rank even and you will be really satisfied and you will get the branch that you want now if you observe there is still 14 days left for your revision at the end so these 14 days are very crucial and you need to revise your notes again and at the same time practice mcqs at least 200 a day and of all the 50 days you need to practice five grand tests anywhere that you want doc tutorials or maro anywhere that you want practice five grand tests of minimum and you always have this follow up of the score whether you are on the increasing trend or whether you are going up and down and where are the wrongs that are going you need to correct them right in your notes and then re-revise and re-revise and then you have to uh, attempt another grand test then only you will see a spike in your grand test score so the trick is very simple no more videos keep revising your notes but your notes should be full fledged if you feel you don't have a notes uh, you have my mini harrison go get that mini harrison it is available on my website and mcqs focus on the mcqs the clinically based mcqs no more fact based or one liners only clinical based mcqs if you feel you wanted to go for specialty based uh, questions as well only go with the review books if you want to have the review mcq books for a particular specialty like neurology or gastroenterology just ping me i'll give you the link to download those review books and i think that's it for this video this will give you an overview on how you can start your preparation for neat ss or how you can strategize in this last 50 days so you can fetch and get a below 500 rank and if you still have any doubts or if you want a personalized plan for the next 50 days i am here you just ping me i am available for you i'll make a personalized personalized plan for you and i'm ready to help and that's it for this video if you really liked it please like share and subscribe to my channel dr jtm and that's it for today until next video this is dr jt signing off